being a bigger man, I know just how hard it is to find clothing. Then one day, trawling through Google, I find John Banks Big and Tall Clothing and my whole dreaded shopping experience changes. On my first visit, I literally felt like a kid in a sweet shop. Everything I picked off the rails fitted and I ended up walking out with a huge bag of clothes. So how did John Banks start? Well, John Banks started with fashion um, in the early 60s, doing all the Beatles paraphernalia and all, all fashion menswear, and slowly evolved as the high streets took over, sort of like retail, with Burton's and Foster Brothers. They got pushed out, so they had to evolve the business, and they looked at big sizes. It was a massive jump and a leap of faith for the business, but they, they took that leap of faith and never looked back, really. So how long has the shop stood here? It's been here since 1964 um, and the family actually lived here in the early 60s, 70s and the, the family grew up above the shops and it wasn't until like the late 80s where they moved out and the children became you know, their own successes in their own rights and it, the whole business has now taken full circle and has been inherited by the, the family and it's great because it's a whole new generation. As most shoppers now shop online, do you offer an online service? We offer a full mail order service and a fully interactive website and telephone orders and we have a catalogue. You know, we have all types of medium to actually get our, our range out there. But, you know, we feel that there's no better sense of satisfaction than coming into a hard bricks and mortar store that's got a face because we always feel that it needs a little bit more than just a click of a button. Tell me more about what makes John Banks, John Banks. So why are you different? John Banks has become, in its own right, specialists within a specialist market. You know, there's lots of people out there offering big sizes, but nobody seems to understand big sizes. Every customer that comes through our door has what we call his own criteria of size fits and dilemmas of, of what he does or what he needs and we're here to help so there's nothing we can't achieve as a business customers will come from far afield we had somebody from Gatwick on Saturday um, somebody drove down from the Lake District the other week and when you get a phone call from somebody in complete desperation that they can't get clothing anywhere and you're like we're here we don't want to be the last place to come we want to be the first and that's the difference it's about getting us recognition for the, for the services that we offer really so you've mentioned that you're a specialist in a specialist market for big and tall clothing, but you also offer a tailoring service? Yes, we do. We do have a tailoring service and it's really important that people get to know about what we can actually do with a product. Because many a customer comes in here with a specific style or shape that they want to achieve and they'll try stuff on and it won't fit. And you're like, but well, we can make it fit. It doesn't necessarily fit your first time off the shelf because you've got a standard block. Um, you know, with this new tapered fit or one thing or another. But the one thing that we do have a trouble with is guys with Odemas. We opened up the seam and put in a, a two inch piece of expandable lycra material, which didn't look obtrusive, it looked really, really clean. And we turned that around in like 24 hours. He felt comfortable, it wasn't such a problem then. And now he knows that he can get the product and that field of expertise, he's already said he's coming back for more. You don't have to accept what's there if a shirt's too long, we shorten it. If a shirt's too too big, we make it smaller. Because we get a lot of guys with big necks. And you know, their the shirts are massive. And you're like, it's not a problem, it's just shorten the sleeve, taper it in. Now you've got a neck that fits you, a shirt that fits you, and it's, it's virtually bespoke. Is that kind of service expensive if they need tailoring? We don't make any money on the tailoring. It is exactly what it is, it's a service. There's a small charge, only what the tailor charges us. And you know, we don't take advantage of people's needs. We never have done. And that's what really sets us above the rest. We, we're not in this just for the money. We're making it about the person and making that person go out feeling good about themselves because we don't want them looking terrible in our clothes. They look at it and go, that's a really nice shirt. Where'd you get it from? And they go, yeah, I got John Banks. And we John Banks because John Banks is the place to go. And you ask any guy that comes in here, that's what they go out saying. That's the level of service you can't just, you can't just pick up on the high street. And that's why we stand alone. If, like me, you're a bigger man, I cannot recommend John Banks clothing highly enough.
Not only is there a vast amount of clothing, so much so that you're gonna be flicking through rails and rails of shirts and trousers, the customer service is second to none. 